preschool families, it's Gisa from Butterfly Garden. I'm here to play the knock-knock game again with my daughter Adele, who's gonna be helping me out. If you'll remember, last week we introduced four sounds and letters. This week we're going to introduce five new sounds and letters. And uh, we're gonna show you again how to play the knock-knock game and then give you variations so that you can practice all week long playing different games um, and mastering the sounds. So here we go, are you ready? Knock, knock. Who's there? It. It. Knock, knock. Who's there? Remember, we're not putting a vowel um, behind that sound, so we're not saying puh, it's Knock, knock. Who's there? Knock, knock. Who's there? Er. Uh. Now, that one's a tricky one because most of us say er, putting an er in front of that r, and it's er. Great. Last one, kiddo. Knock, knock. Who's there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's another one that's hard, right? Because we tend to say yeah, and it's yeah. Great, that just makes it easier, parents, when we put sounds together. Um, it's, it's just keeping those sounds really individual and crisp. So, you've gotten all those sounds. Remember, another way to play is to, so you can play this a couple times. Um, it doesn't have to take a long time. Each day, if you spend, 10 minutes, five, 10 minutes doing this, that's perfect. Um, if you do it consistently every day, you're really gonna see results. So the second way to play on the second day of the week, go ahead. Knock, knock. Who's there? Yeah. Yeah. And then Adele, can you trace that? Always starting at the top, very nice. And then can you do it in the salt, in the sand tray? Very nice. All right, let's do one more just to show them. Knock, knock. Who's there? Er. Great. And then can you trace that? And then we'll trace it on here. Yes, great. So that is another variation. A third way you can play this game is again starting with a knock knock. Knock knock. Who's there? Eh. Eh. Can you find an object that starts with eh? What did you bring? An instrument. An instrument. Very good. And where are you going to put that? Perfect. All right. Knock, knock. Who's there? Yeah. Very nice. I like how you really isolated that sound. Can you find an object? What did you bring? A yo-yo. Yes, and what sound does it start with? Yeah. Yeah. Great. All right, knock, knock. Knock, knock. Who's there? Er. er. Can you find an object that starts with er? What do you have there? A ruler. A ruler, perfect. All right. that starts with a What's that? Paint. Paint starts with Excellent. Last one. Knock knock. Who's there? K -k. Find an object that starts with a K. Beautiful. Can 
can you put that with our great parents another way you can play this is instead of going to find an individual object after each sound is having them do all the sounds and then one by one pointing to a, a letter and having them go find the object that starts with that letter after they've done all of the sounds. Um, all right, Adele, do you mind putting those off to the side for me? And then for those children who know all of their sounds, like 95 to 100% um, accuracy, then you can take last week's sounds, which do you remember what they are? Ah, ah. And now, remember, parents, really don't rush the kiddos. Honor where they're at because um, this can be frustrating if your, ch if your child is not really strong with the sounds. That's why we play the knock-knock game and all the variations to really help them feel comfortable. And then once they are really comfortable, you each week you can just keep adding the um, letters so that they can spell their own words. So Adele, let's do a few words with all of the sounds from last week and all of the sounds from this week. Her, eh, rip. Excellent, let's do it one more time. Her, eh, rip. rip. Great, and why don't you try one or two more? One more time. T -er -e -trip. Trip. Wonderful. Would you like to try one more? All right. Thank you again for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe so that you can keep viewing our lessons.